good game. I just didn't find it fun. Like, I had some of the guys over. I had some girls over, too. Mm. So I'm getting loving. Ugh, fabulous. <laughs> I actually got plans this weekend with some girls. Ugh. We know, we know. Tim, no, Tim's not a player. <laughs> um, but, um, yeah, I had some of the friends over. And all the hype wasn't really worth it. I mean, there was some really good plays, actually. Sorry if I'm sniffling, you know. We got allergies. Oh, y'all know. Yeah, y'all know. Hope so. I mean, y'all might not have allergies. If you don't, well, count your blessings. It might... It might go in the right way. Well, either way, it's gonna lead pretty much to the same thing. Oh, it's like... What? Okay, yeah, I'm pretty much going to the right thing. Oh, my God. Forgot there was fast travel. I forgot there was fast travel in this game, I'm used to Batman. Well, this is why I say, don't record games so close together. Give yourself a little break. Hey? Evening. Are you? Should've stayed in Rivet City. Travel through the wasteland for this place. You should die, that's what you should do, you piece of... Never mind. Wonderful, wonderful weather we're having today. It's actually getting really cold, and it's only in October. Yep, it's true. Crater Shot Supply. Alright, let's go talk to Mariah, or Moria, or Mortia, I don't even know. Yeah, I tried to kill more and more raddies, but you know, stuff happened. Hey, don't mind the smell. I was just testing a few chemicals, but it's perfectly safe to breathe. Really? <laughs> you sick fucking bastard. Oh, I can't wait to hear how the repellent's working. Oh, come on. You barely even left. Damn it. Just a few? Well, I'm sure it'll be good enough. Yeah, so, well. How did my chemical repellent work? Safe and clean like a charm, I bet. Um, once for, like you hope, the more rats all died. They repelled their limbs from the body. Can you. <laughs> That's not how it was supposed to work at all. Poor little mole ratties, their little noses. <laughs> That's just horrible. No, it was pretty funny. I guess it's back to the drawing board for that repellent. I wonder if I can make it into some sort of fuel. Anyway, I'll just take that. No, I want to keep it. Oh, but for your trouble, um, here, have the leftover chems from working on the repellent. I'm sure you can find some use for them. Yeah, I can. Oh, jets? Yeah, sure. Psychos. Repellent? Oh. Right. There's a lot we don't know about Meyer Lurks. Ew, how intelligent no. and dangerous they are. That definitely deserves research. No, it doesn't. I hesitate to ask, but I'll need to examine the effects of serious physical trauma. I wouldn't ask if I couldn't fix you up afterwards, of course. So what, you want me to go and get that beaten? that should be it for the second chapter. Which do you want to check out? Um... <laughs> What do you mean about handling injury? Well, I never get to study anyone who's severely injured. Not without them crying to be fixed right away or trying to bleed out and all that. <laughs> but obviously, you can handle a lot of abuse. So if I'm ever going to find a good example of human anatomy well, and injury resistance, it'd be you. Next time you get badly injured, return here so I can examine you before I heal you up. I mean, you're going to get yourself hurt anyway, right? <laughs> Sure. Wow, what a great research assistant you are. I mean, really, that's dedication. Demonstrating how to withstand pain by getting injured? Wow. When you're ready, come back here with some serious injuries. Maybe a crippled limb or two, and I'll take notes and fix you up. Oh, I'll be waiting here with plenty of bandages for you. Don't worry. Just go get horribly injured. Oh, and be careful. You are bipolar. I know how to do this. <laughs> we got this, guys. Any crippled limbs? The power huh? of hmm. Well, here in his favored land, 
Attend now to the word. Good enough. Wow. Let's go up to a pretty high. Oh, I'm gonna wait for a while. Yeah, I don't like the darkness. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, I'm just gonna stand here for 12 hours, you know. You don't mind? No, really, I guess. But that's a weird shot. God, it gets early in this place. Or get it gets bright early in this place. God, it gets brighter around like 6.30 here. As of right now, we'll start getting brighter earlier soon. I'm going to this one do the other savings time, so now we can start around 6.30. Used to not. I don't know how it gets light around 6.30. Oh, you yeah, didn't light earlier. Let's make my gun. Go get seriously injured. Oh, and be careful. Huh? What? Hey, nice sofa you got here. That wasn't ruined at all. You, you want me to get crippled, right? You want something? Can you break my legs? That's... Go get plan B. Let's go get hurt. Go get hurt the safer way. Um, receive a crippling injury. Does death count as injuries? Um, where's Moira? Moira, how, how, how do you spell her name? Moira? I think it's Moira. Oh. Are you gonna make me wait another 10, 11, 12 hours? Really, man? God, how long does it take to come back to life after dying? Huh? Let's see what time we start getting on right here. It starts getting light around like. Oh my god. He willers. Um, where's Moira? Where that hell at? Moira. I just Let's see if you can hear that. Yeah, you can. Awesome. What? Oh, hey. Leave me out of that girl's crazy experiments. I don't get paid enough for that. Okay. I'd like to know where she is. Mm, we can go watch her sleep. If I can find her, I want to do like a stalker kind of thing. Dang it! Well, how do you feel? Um. Dang it! Um. Couldn't do that. It'd be a real blow to the oh, dang, dang it. Let me see what you have for sale. I need some ammo, kind of. Oh, you don't have any. Okay, so. Let's go get hurt by some enemies, you know? Same old, same old. Same shit, different day. Let's go out there and get close to death. Take one for the team. Take death for the team. Dang it, I was hoping that would break. <coughs> Alright, I got a plan for this. Plan F. I don't even know what plan we're on anymore. But um, what I'm gonna go do is I'm gonna go out there, find an enemy, let it hurt me. Hopefully, cripple them too. No, that'd be cool. What if not cripple them? At least, it'll give me now a little health. So, then we're back. The friendliest town around is like the only town around. Where's an Emony? Emony. Oh, what's that? 
Actually, the easy way would be. Don't you hurt these men? Okay. I missed it. Are you mad? Broken limb, yeah. Get mad. Get mad. Come on, matter. Purple. Yeah, I know. Get mad, come on. Yeah. Hurt me, hurt me. Come on, ow. That hurts. Ow. Ooh, ow. Come on, you can do better than this. You can do better. You're almost there. I mean, you can do better. You're listening to Arcade Radio. I'm John Henry, President of the Arcade, President of America, President of your heart. This is life. I know. You see, become seriously injured. This is not helping out. This is life. You have to do this next to I beg to differ. Let's go. Megaton. Okay, that worked. Better than expected. Okay, then I'm gonna do that mirror cat or whatever. I don't even know. What was it? Mirror lurker thing? Something like that. I'm quite that stupid. Oh, my phone. Okay. I got a broken head and a broken torso. Oh, God, that scared me. I'm scared easily today. Hmm. Oh, walk the basket. Come on. Where's more of You know. Isn't that cool? This oh, really I know it does, now. dear. But it's for a good cause. Uh, try not to squirm so much while I take notes. Now. How would you describe the pain you're feeling? Any advice for how to keep it from being overwhelming? And remember, this is for posterity. <laughs> you know what the hell, so there's the fear of death, there's a lot of both. My only solace is thinking about inflicting the pain on people like you. Ah, oh, yes, uh, that makes a lot of sense. And it does help when you're sewing up wounds and setting bones, too. That seems like it'd be tough to do alone. Luckily, I'm here to patch you up. Now, hold still and quit fidgeting. Ugh! How can you be walking around like this? You told me to go cripple myself. Okay. I even stitched a little smiley face in you to keep up your spirits. It's kind of hard to see from your side, though. Here, take this environment suit of mine. It will help with medical tasks, and it should help prevent the effects of exposure, too. Medex environment suit. Worth it. Yes, knowing more about them can help people learn to avoid or even outsmart them. So I picked up this observer device to study them in their natural habitat. I need you to hide one in one of the spawning pods in their lairs. Oh my god. That's great. I recommend the nest at the Anchorage War Memorial. I knew a trader who talked about the Meyer Lurks down there. Just go inside and find one of their spawning pods, probably down near the water. Put this observer inside and get out quietly. And be sure not to kill any Meyer Lurks inside their nest. If you do, it could ruin the validity of the study. Okay, cool. Let's go. I promise I'm not going to kill any. I'm done if they see me and like, try to kill me. So, we're off to see the mirror looks.
Where is this place you want me to go to? Yay! Okay, I remembered I can fast travel. After we finish this part of this research book chapter thingy. Yeah, I said it like that, bro. You mad? No. After we finish this part of the chapter, I'm going to call it quits for recording for the day. At least until I go record my craft. So, where are they at? This is where I just was. That's fine. Um, where is Zerb's spawning pod? Where's that spawning pod? Is this where it is? Yep. Well, this is the Anchorage Memorial 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 Yeah, sure. Memorial Facility. So, yeah. Let's try it down here. Where's the spawning? This is, is this where I just was? No, I don't think so. This is spawning pod. <gasps> Dead body. Oh, I'm sorry. Ow. Okay. Just <laughs> tell me where your spawning pot is and I'll leave. Okay. Um, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Where's your spawning pod? No, I could just look that shit there. Look that crap. Mmm, Maybe. Maybe. Spawning pod, maybe. Okay, near look. This could easily be a spawning pod out here. Um, okay. Look, I'm trying not to kill y'all. So... Oh! You would just hop off. Much appreciated. Is this their spawning pod? I did. Oh! Yes! Got it. Better not find that. Can they find it? That would suck if they could. Okay, there's an observer here. Let's take it out. Yeah, I'm proud. You know, I'm kind of half dead. I wanted to do these at the same time. Really? It didn't have to be like this. I'm just taking out. I'm just gonna take all this. You know, because why not? Yeah. Everything went better than expected. Can I fast travel? Please. Not really nearby. No. It will take a minute to find me. Just that. Uh, okay. I wouldn't have found me if I wouldn't have came up. So, I got almost fell down there again. Okay, we're almost out. I hope. Yeah, we're almost out. And get out of here. Oh, this is a sad little boy. Think good human, a cool character. Boy. You kill will have an ear on their corpse, which can be sold or traded to a certain evil kid. Oh my god, that's weird. Ten points of damage, poison. And maybe now, question. Yeah. Okay. Now we're almost done. Now we're getting somewhere. Now you're thinking with portals. Now I'm referencing things. Now it's 20% cooler, bro. No, ha ha, my little funny reference, I'm so cool. Second time in two recordings, yay. I cool, bro. Hey. 
How you doing? You doing good? Yeah, there you go. You doing good. You doing very good. There you go. Alright, Moira. Here's your stupid... Wait. I'm guessing she can see the... the lead there first. So, are they intelligent? Do they have a leader? Some sort of king? Or priests? Or some sort of scaly community center? I don't know. I'll bet most people would have just gone in there, guns blazing without half a thought. But not you. You're the best research assistant ever. I've been getting a good signal. But what do you think about them from your first-hand observations of them? Um, uh, you know, they're definitely oh, vicious. that's unpleasant. But I guess it's no surprise. Practically everything out there can eat us. This bottom of the food chain thing really sucks. Some of We're these observations the about their armor and camouflage gave me an idea for reinforced, neutral-colored headgear. Here, consider it thanks for not interfering with them. Oh, speaking of which, take these, so you can continue to avoid them in the future. Stealth boys, cool. Shady hat, shady's back, 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 back again. Absolutely. I'm glad to finish it up. I bet you're even happier, right? Hello. Just one last chapter now, and it's much safer. I promise. Oh, and here's your payment. Two big boxes full of ammo. Think of it as insurance, in case the next chapter isn't as safe as I predict. It won't be. The last no, chapter is a bit more esoteric. It it's about the survival of humanity as a whole, and how to rebuild society. Deep stuff, huh? We need to know how large settlements are formed, how to harness the old technology, and I'll need you to get ancient history from a nearby library. We're in the last stretch now, so let's finish it up strong. What's first? Well, let's go ahead and check out what all we got. From her, like that suit and all. Well, let's see. Environment suit. Med plus 5, rad resistance plus 30. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I like that. Oh, wait. We can't wear our shady hat. Sneak plus 5. Okay. I want to see how beautiful we look. Oh, look at us, man. We're. Mm. This is not fashion, man. My bad. So, the next time, guys, I hope you enjoyed. This is Tim's LPs, and I'm not good at sign outs, to say the least. Hey, guys, Tim's LPs, I hope you enjoyed. Blah 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 blah. Bam.